five, four, three, two, one, fire. The revolution is a resource, and we got enough started up. Countdown to the scientists. Hello, this is Mr. Onbasi, chemistry teacher at River City Science Academy, and he will be performing a couple of experiments today with students Mark Ronan and Jalal Alajalin. Now, Mr. Onbasi, would you like to tell us a few things about your experiments? Sure. So, uh, I assigned AP Chemistry students an AP Chemistry project, and there are like 27 projects online, and we are going to perform four experiments today. The first experiment we are going to show today is elephant toothpaste. And the second one is going to be called carbide cannon. And the third one, we are going to do this with iron spheres. Okay, one of them is going to be covered with aluminum, and that's called smashing thermite reaction. And the last one, it's going to be called, it's going to be called whoosh bottle. First step, goggles. Check. Second step, experiment. Catalyst. Wait, you didn't move it! Oh, oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> As you can see, this is an exothermic <laughs> reaction, and it's emitting heat right now. As you can see, it's shrinking right now because of how much air. It... So, goggles check. So we have two iron balls coated with rusted iron, um, iron oxide, and one of them will be covered in aluminum. We don't have that much aluminum. But when it's a smashing thermite reaction, so when we when they hit with enough force, the iron oxide on the surface of the sphere will switch with the aluminum, turning the part that I just smashed and exploded into aluminum oxide. As so. So the first thing we did is we put about 100 milliliters of water into this flask. Next, we're going to add some calcium carbide, which reacts with water to create acetylene gas, which is highly combustible. Then, we will light it and shoot a cork to the ceiling. Very good back. <laughs> Here we have the whoosh bottle. And I've already coated the inside of it in isopropyl alcohol 91%. And now we're going to show a combustion reaction and shows what happens after you light it on fire. So I'm going to step back and we're going to dim the lights. My friend Dalal here is going to light it up. <laughs> Thank you so much, Mr. Ambasi, Mark, and Jalal for your amazing science experiment. And thank you for watching the Rocket Fuel Science Special.